Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. On this channel, you'll find financial, travel, and more videos just like the one you're watching right now. If you like what you see, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. Hello everyone, this is financial author Ahmed Dan of AhmedDan.com. Today I'll have another episode of unboxing and brief review video, and I'll be presenting uh, the CIBC Aerogold Visa Infinite credit card. I'd like to mention that uh, this is not a paid or affiliated review. Uh, all my reviews are unbiased and non-affiliated. So the what you're gonna hear and the opinions are totally honest and unbiased. And I'm expecting this uh, review about 15-20 minutes uh, long. I'm going to cover lots of things. For example, insurance coverages and how does this compare, card compare with the another airplane credit card which is the TD airplane uh, visa infinite credit card so stick to the end of this video and you'll be learning a lot of uh, import important information which uh, will help you uh, to make a wise decision uh, based on uh, all the information uh, I'm going to be providing you today now I have another uh, review and unboxing video of the another credit card which is the American Express Mm, airplane plus gold uh, credit card uh, I applied for that card and the CIBC Aerogold uh, Visa Infinite card at the same time so that uh, review and unboxing is going to be published before uh, this one and uh, I'm not going to compare the American Express Aerogold uh, Airplane Plus uh, credit card with the CIBC Aerogold Visa Infinite because American Express um, Airplane Plus card doesn't uh, offer many insurance features uh, but this card uh, which is the CIBC and the other card is TD they are very similar and they offer lots of features for that reason I'm going to be comparing these two credit cards so let's start the unboxing and then as I go through the, through the unboxing and I'll provide you more information uh, and features of this credit card so here is the full package uh, and here's the back side of the package so slowly, I'm going to take out the whole thing out of the envelope. Okay, so the envelope is empty now and I'll put it here. And so this is the whole package uh, you'll be receiving with this card if you apply for this card. And then uh, here is the introductory letter and here we have the card uh, inside or on the back. I'll set this aside for now. Let's go through some features and then uh, in the brochure and then I'll come back to the card. So we have a brochure or manual which I'll go through shortly. And then we have these two uh, pieces. Let's take a look at these. Okay, so this is important information about travel insurance on select CIBC cards. Uh, okay, so here this is just uh, some uh, policy changes uh, I don't need to go through the whole thing here so I'll just set it aside here and then about this one important information about CIBC mobile payment application uh, CIBC will no longer support CIBC mobile payment app okay so this is not relevant to the credit card so I'll just you know, set it aside here and then we have this uh, brochure here it's, it's, it looks like a nice looking brochure so we'll go through one by one okay so let's take a look here okay so it reads this way but when you open it oh, actually it reads this way as well so here thank you for choosing uh, CIBC Gold uh, Visa Infinite credit card and uh, here are the some things you need to do activate your card create a Visa Infinite profile uh, in terms of this uh, Visa Infinite profile, if you have a profile with any other Visa Infinite credit card, you don't need to create that again. Uh, you can use uh, the same profile. Uh, as of right, as of this uh, this video recording, I have uh, three Visa Infinite credit cards, and uh, whenever I call them, they ask me which credit card I would like to, you know, use, and I just tell them the one. So you don't need to do this again and again. You just need to do it once in your life. And then uh, here, registers, sign up for Apple Pay, enroll in Visa Checkout. Okay, that's fine. And table of contents. 
accelerating your earning and some of the benefits okay so we'll go move over to the next page okay so here uh, they're talking about uh, the earn rate uh, on this credit card so you earn one, one airplane mile for every one dollar but there is uh, some accelerated categories where you're going to be earning 1.5 miles for each dollar and these categories are grocery gas and drug stores and on aircanada.com purchases so that's a very nice thing to have uh, for uh, at these categories you're going to be earning more miles and uh, let's take a look here and your airplane miles will never expire okay so this is an added feature uh, steady uh, visa infinite airplane has the same feature so in order to keep your airplane uh, miles active you need to have one transaction each year so let's say you have this card or even the TD airplane card and if you do not do any transaction then the system will uh, do a transaction and deposit one airplane mile in your account just to keep the account active so this is a nice feature but if you're having this credit card then I highly doubt anyone will not be using this uh, you know uh, will not be having a transaction in a given you know, one year period okay so other additional cards uh, $50 annual fee if you're having any additional cards and then authorized user spending limit at no additional charges okay uh, this is a feature actually lots of banks do not offer so let's say if you have uh, if you're giving your card to someone else then you can control how much you know uh, they can use uh, some cards for example let's say you have twenty thousand dollars credit limit and if you give the card to an authorized user the user is going to have full access of the twenty thousand dollars limit which is not a good thing sometimes but with this card uh, you can actually limit uh, the uh, amount the authorized user is going to access so this is a nice feature auto pay service to help you on top of your payments not important uh, this is the Taj Mahal okay uh, here they're talking about airplane status which I don't need to uh, go through let's uh, move on here okay so here they're talking about how to redeem airplane miles and fixed mileage flight rewards and all sort of stuff now if you're having an airplane card you're gonna get the best value of your airplane if you only use that for business class flight redemptions if you're buying merchandises or if you're just like you know doing other stuff with your airplane uh, miles or let's even if you're flying economic class then you're not gonna get the most value so I always recommend that whenever you're redeeming any uh, miles for example example airplane miles or any other airline miles so go for business class uh, redemptions and that's the way you're gonna get the most value of your uh, miles booking and cancellation flexibility uh, book your ticket up to two hours before departure we can do that with airplane cancel up to two hours before so these are the common features of airplane uh, we'll move to the next one here the visa infinite concierge uh, which is one of my favorite concierges so basically you can call them anytime and they can do anything for you it even doesn't have to be travel related uh, they can book your ticket they can find you stuff uh, they can uh, you know give you tour find you tour but let's say if you want to ask them something totally not related to travel uh, or anything they will they can do that too so I use them a lot um, for example my last trip to India and Bangladesh uh, a lot of uh, the uh, itineraries were totally uh, made by the Visa Infinite Concierge and I have another trip coming up uh, Australia, New Zealand, Singapore and most probably uh, Malaysia and the Visa Infinite Concierge will be setting up lots of uh, tours and uh, uh, other items for me as well okay so now here Air Canada benefits uh, okay these I don't need to go through it your it says that get access to priority check-in receive a complimentary first check bag and take advantage of the one-time guest access benefit on air canada maple leaf lounge priority boarding uh, these all sound good when but the catch is in order to have all these you're gonna have to redeem your airplane for air canada 
and you don't want to do that because Air Canada charges hefty fuel surcharges and if you redeem airplane for Air Canada you're going to be paying money unnecessarily for example if you go from uh, let's say here to Europe or Asia and if you choose uh, Air Canada to fly business class with airplane then you're going to be paying about five six hundred dollars fuel surcharges but if you choose any other airlines from the Star Airlines uh, airlines then some of them do not charge any fuel surcharges and you can fly for paying like in you know, a total let's say twenty dollars or fifty dollars for example uh, I flew to Asia recently uh, Bangladesh uh, from here I didn't pay any fuel surcharges I think I paid maybe twenty or something for the whole trip for one way from Toronto to Istanbul and Istanbul to Dhaka but let's see if I had chosen airplane I'm sorry uh, not airplane Air Canada then I would have paid for the same uh, trip uh, five to seven hundred fuel surcharges so you don't want to do that uh, you don't want to fly Air Canada with airplane uh, because they are not good you know giving for flight redemptions they charge hefty fuel surcharges okay so now visa infinite Lux luxury hotel collection that's another benefit of uh, visa infinite i'll not go into that and here are some of the other benefits of visa infinite cover uh, which is uh, they actually uh, you know give you uh, lots of things so you can just you know check on visa infinite concierge websites okay now the insurances which is the most important thing so all uh, flip to the next page and here uh, it has a listing of the insurances uh, and I'm going to go through them and I'm going to actually compare them with uh, the TD Aeroplan Visa Infinite card I have some notes here so let's start with the first number just to do it this way and bring it close to the camera lens okay so the first one is the outer province emergency medical travel so this is just the medical insurance when you uh, go to foreign countries or anywhere uh, yeah, living in a province then the foreign uh, emergency medical uh, travel kicks in and the amount uh, this card offer is five million dollars for each insured person and it has 15 days if you are under 64 and only three days if you are over 65 okay now TD offers very similar uh, insurance coverages but they offer 1 million total instead of 5 million uh, so here CIBC wins you got 5 million dollars coverage and TD only covers 1 million TD meaning TD airplane visa infinite card and if you're over 64 then TD has actually four days, but CI has uh, CIBC has uh, three days. So TD gives you one day extra, but the total amount is lower, one million, and here we have five million. That's a very important insurance you need to have when you, whenever you're traveling. And the second insurance is trip cancellation and trip in interruption. So here, CIBC uh, in terms of trip cancellation, you're getting uh, one thousand dollars of eligible trip cancellation for each person uh, to a maximum of uh, $5,000 and uh, this is same for the TD Aeroplan Visa Infinite $1,000 and $5,000 and if you look at trip interruption then CIBC is giving you up to $2,000 uh, per insured person and here actually TD wins uh, TD is giving you $5,000 per insured person up to a maximum of $25,000 for trip interruption. CIBC is giving you $2,000 per person, but it doesn't mention here how much is the total. So I couldn't tell you how much is the total. Uh, you can definitely call CIBC if you'd like to you know, make sure what is the total amount. For example, TD's total amount is $25,000, $5,000 per person. So TD wins in here. And then we have here common carrier accident insurance. Uh, this one is actually six five hundred thousand uh, dollars if accident happens for you or your uh, insured members. And then here five hundred five hundred thousand dollars and travel accident. TD has actually okay this uh, two two million dollars but I believe that's that's different than some 
not this one. This is usually standard for each credit card, uh, $500,000. And let's say we have uh, this insurance is total uh, very similar uh, to what we have at TD offers. And uh, if you need to find out more, or let's say if you have TD Aeroplan Visa Infinite card or CIBC Aerogold Visa Infinite, and uh, you know if you need to clarify something, definitely you can call their customer services. For example, for TD, I saw a total of two million dollars, but I don't think that's like you know each item. It's just probably they're adding up uh, to a two million dollars total. But I saw uh, for TD Aeroplan Visa Infinite same five hundred thousand dollars each item. So that's something you can clarify. Okay. Now here, let's move on to the next one, which is the flight delay and baggage insurance which is a very important insurance if you are traveling so CIBS is giving you five hundred dollars uh, up to 100 for ground transportation and 100 for entertainment and expenses and if your flight is delayed for more than four hours your insurance also includes five hundred dollars per un uninsured person one thousand dollars aggregate limit Okay, so this one actually TD is giving you the same, so there's no difference. Uh, but the baggage delay, uh, CIBC is giving you, if your trip is delayed for more than six hours, uh, okay, so CIBC is giving you uh, $500 per person, $1,000 aggregate limit for loss, theft or damage of your check baggage okay so here CIBS is giving you $500 per person but TD actually has more here TD gives you $1000 per person and except this everything is pretty much similar for TD as well okay now auto rental loss auto rental collision and, and uh, loss damage insurance so this one, uh, if you decline the rental company's uh, insurance, then your credit card actually covers it. And I'm not going to go into detail here, but for this one, TD and CIBC has the same insurance coverage. And the next one is purchase security and extended uh, protection insurance. Uh, this is usually standard for most credit cards. You get 90 days of purchase protection if you know your stuff are lost, or stolen. Or damaged and you get one additional year warranty than the manufacturer's warranty uh, so it's not uh, you know too much differences in this section uh, another thing I found that here uh, CIBC doesn't mention anything about lost baggage so my guess is five hundred thousand dollars it's not clear here you know how much is for lost baggage but it's a uh, could be five hundred thousand dollars but if you need to clarify definitely you can call CIBC okay so move on to the next section our next page so here we have uh, just how to manage your money online uh, I don't need to go into details about that emergency card replacement up to five thousand dollars in emergency cash uh, that's standard for most credit cards Enhanced monthly statement. Uh, this one actually CIBC statement shows categorized uh, expenses. Let's see if you're purchasing everything with your credit card. Then it gives a breakdown of under which category you're spending how much, which is I like. Not if, not many credit card companies does that, but CIBC does that. So that's a very good feature to have. Online spend report. Uh, this one I never used it but it's again a nice feature to have so we'll move on to the next one alert security so here we have a spend alert fraud alert create report alert identity theft alert uh, one thing I'd like to mention that if you have a CIBC credit card CIBC actually give you free uh, free credit uh, score and free credit alert uh, TD does not do that so CABC has that and you can access this from your app. I check my credit score using the CABC and other free uh, services. 
and I do have a great uh, YouTube article on a free great uh, score you can watch that later on okay so here important contact information uh, very nothing much and here all the uh, benefits are all the footnotes so here nothing to mention and here's kind of a card and booklet have all the contact numbers listed which is nothing I mean which is a good thing to have and then here is the insurance certificate for out-of-province uh, medical emergency and all other insurance services which I don't need to go through it okay so there's something I wanted to show you let me just see if I can quickly find it here okay so what I'm looking for is that uh, most of the insurance pro, uh, insurances this card offer is provided by here Royal and Sand uh, okay where is this here Royal and Sand Alliance Insurance Company RNS uh, this company is a very reputable insurance company I didn't hear any bad uh, you know uh, reviews or ratings for this insurance company so this is a good thing about this card that you're dealing with a reputable insurance company not like a Scotia American Express gold trade card where the insurance company has lots of bad ratings and reviews and it's very hard to you know get uh, your uh, get anything back in case you need to submit any claims but this is a good company same as TD TD uh, credit card company credit card uh, TD uh, airplane visa infinite card insurance is provided by TD's own insurance uh, which is again a good company to deal with so in terms of uh, insurance providers uh, if you ask me to choose uh, between uh, let's say TD and CIBC depending on the insurance provider I would go with CIBC because of the Royal and Sun I like them and they're one of the best providers in Canada and I never heard any uh, you know bad ratings or reviews or any bad experience about them so that would be my choice but TD is not bad either so we're gonna leave it here for now so that one is done and let's go back to your introductory letter okay so here uh, just a standard letter thank you for choosing your uh, credit card your pin is coming and then if we flip on the other side then I'm going to be showing you some Okay, so here is not much, just a standard credit card uh, terms and conditions. And actually, I had difficulty with this credit card, uh, you know, because they lost my application. And I have a separate video about that experience. You can watch it later. And I'll give also, uh, uh, it will be on my YouTube channel, or I'll give a link in the description box below if I don't forget. Okay, so now let's go to the final segment of this video we're going to take off the card and I'll show you the uh, CIBC Aerogold Visa Infinite Quaker okay so I'm removing it from the letter and just give me a few seconds here okay so here's the CIBC Aerogold Visa Infinite Credit Card and here you have the visa logo right here the only thing I would complain about this that you cannot really see the infinite written here it's very it's hard to see so infinite credit cards are high-end credit cards and if you have infinite written on it then it should be clearly visible but this one is not you know very not really uh, visible it's very difficult to see uh, most people wouldn't even notice that this is an infinite card okay so here we have the CIBC Aragold Visa Infinite credit card uh, if you like what you see please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing and I do have more credit card reviews and credit card tips and lots of articles on my YouTube channel uh, so if you like them uh, subscribe and There'll be new videos coming up shortly. Thank you.